Happy Saturday to you. I'm Local 6 meteorologist Elizabeth Hart. Thanks for clicking on JustWeather.com. This is becoming a trend. We had another record-setting day. We tied the record in Orlando at 85 degrees. The old record was 85, set back in the 20s, and we set a brand new record in Daytona with 83 degrees. The old record of 82 was set back in 1987. So it's still warm out there this evening, and we will have warm temperatures overnight. Typically, we're down in the 50s this time of the year. Not so much this evening. Most most of us in the upper 60s, even a few balmy low 70s out at the Brevard Coast. And just like last evening, we will see some fog developing, some of which could be rather thick in the low lying areas as we advance towards sunrise. For the rest of the Saturday evening, clouds drifting through just an outside chance of a couple of stray showers. We've had some of those tonight, and that chance will continue through midnight and into early Sunday morning. Most of us starting the day dry, but again with a lot of low clouds and some potentially thick fog towards sunrise. As we head into the afternoon, we'll see patchy clouds around, but we will have some peaks of sunshine, just a very slim chance of a shower, mostly along the Rivard and Volusia coastline. You can see that rain potentially pushing inland as we head towards 7 o'clock tomorrow evening, but all in all, a pretty nice forecast with continued warm temperatures. Upper 60s at 8 a.m. tomorrow with some fog around, 82 your noontime number, heading up near record territory once again. We're forecasting a high of 86. Mid 80s again on Monday and Tuesday. We'll introduce a chance of some scattered showers then. And we do get some cooler air working in just in time for the new year. The front coming through during New Year's Day with a high of only 70 on Saturday.